scan format string refers to a control parameter used by a class of functions in the string processing libraries of various programming languages. The format string specifies a method for reading a string into an arbitrary number of varied data type parameter, s. The input string is by default read from the standard input, but variants exist that read the input from other sources. The term scanf is due to the C language, which popularized this type of function, but these functions predate C, and other names are used, such as READF and ALGOL68. Scanf format strings, which provide formatted input, are complementary to PRINTF format strings, which provide formatted output. In both cases these provide simple functionality and fixed format compared to more sophisticated and flexible parses or template engines, but are sufficient for many purposes. Usage, the scan function, which is found in C, reads input for numbers and other data types from standard input. The following shows code in C that reads a variable number of unformatted decimal integers from the console and prints out each of them on a separate line. After being processed by the program above, a messy list of integers such as 456 123 789 456 12, 456 1, 23 78, will appear neatly as 456 123 789 456 12 456 1, 23 78 to print out a word. No matter what the data type the programmer wants the program to read, the arguments must be pointers pointing to memory. Otherwise, the function will not perform correctly because it will be attempting to overwrite the wrong sections of memory, rather than pointing to the memory location of the variable you are attempting to get input for. In the last example an address of operator is not used for the argument, as word is the name of an array of char as such it is equivalent to a pointer to the first element of the array. While the expression and word would numerically evaluate to the same value, semantically it is an entirely different meaning in that it stands for the address of the whole array rather than an element of it. This fact needs to be kept in mind when assigning scanf output to strings. As scanf is designated to read only from standard input, many programming languages with interfaces, such as PHP, have derivatives such as SSCANF and FSCANF but not SCANF itself. Format string specifications The formatting placeholders in SCANF are more or less the same as that in PRINTF, its reverse function. There are rarely constants in a format string, mainly because a program is usually not designed to read known data. The exception is one or more white space characters, which discards all white space characters in the input. Some of the most commonly used placeholders follow. Percent da scan an integer is assigned decimal number. Percent d scan an integer is assigned number. Similar to percent d, but interprets the number as hexadecimal when preceded by 0x and octal when preceded by 0. For example, the string 031 would be read as 31 using percent d, and 25 using percent i. The flag H in percent %i indicates conversion to a short and HH conversion to a char. Percent %way scan for decimal unsigned int. Correspondingly, percent %who scans for an unsigned short and percent %hhu for an unsigned char. Percent %far scan a floating point number in normal notation. Percent %g, percent %gar scan a floating point number in either normal or exponential notation. Percent %g uses lower case letters and percent %g uses upper case. Percent %x, percent %za scan an integer as an unsigned hexadecimal number. Percent %o scan an integer as an octal number. Percent %za scan a character string. The scan terminates at white space. A null character is stored at the end of the string, which means that the buffer supplied must be at least one character longer than the specified input length. Percent car scan a character. No null character is added. White space, any white space characters trigger a scan for zero or more white space characters. The number and type of white space characters do not need to match in either direction. Percent LFA scan as a double floating point number. Percent LFA scan as a long double floating point number. 
the above can be used in compound with numeric modifiers and the L, L modifiers which stand for long in between the percent symbol and the letter. There can also be numeric values between the percent symbol and the letters, preceding the long modifiers if any, that specifies the number of characters to be scanned. An optional asterisk right after the percent symbol denotes that the datum read by this format specifier is not to be stored in a variable. No argument behind the format string should be included for this dropped variable. The FF modifier in PRINTF is not present in SCANF, causing differences between modes of input and output. The LL and HH modifiers are not present in the C90 standard, but are present in the C99 standard. An example of a format string is %7D %ZAR %C %LF. The above format string scans the first seven characters as a decimal integer, then reads the remaining as a string until a space, new line or tab is found, then scans the first non-white space character following and a double precision floating point number afterwards. Error handling SCANF is usually used in situations when the program cannot guarantee that the input is in the expected format. Therefore a robust program must check whether the SCANF call succeeded and take appropriate action. If the input was not in the correct format, the erroneous data will still be on the input stream and must be read and discarded before new input can be read. An alternative method of reading input, which avoids this, is to use FGETS and then examine the string read in. The last step can be done by SSCANF, for example. Security, like PRINTF, SCANF is vulnerable to format string attacks. Great care should be taken to ensure that the formatting string includes limitations for string and array sizes. In most cases the input string size from a user is arbitrary. It cannot be determined before the SCANF function is executed. This means that uses of percent %s placeholders without length specifiers are inherently insecure and exploitable for buffer overflows. Another potential problem is to allow dynamic formatting strings, for example formatting strings stored in configuration files or other user-controlled files. In this case the allowed input length of string sizes cannot be specified unless the formatting string is checked beforehand and limitations are enforced. Related to this are additional or mismatched formatting placeholders which do not match the actual Virag list. These placeholders might be partially extracted from the stack, contain undesirable or even insecure pointers depending on the particular implementation of Virags. See also PRINTF format string, C programming language, C++, PHP, format string attack, references. External links SCANF, 3, a input format conversion a Euro a Linux library functions manual, C++ reference for STD SCANF.